Good evening, faculty, staff, family, and friends, and of course, the class of 2024. And welcome to our Freshman Honors Assembly. I'm Deanne Carter, principal of Bishop McNamara High School, and I'm so honored you are here with us this evening, even though you're virtual. This evening, we will celebrate the academic accomplishments of our ninth grade students. And as we begin all things here at Bishop McNamara, we will begin in prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Good and gracious God, we thank you for giving us so much to celebrate this evening. We thank you for walking alongside each of us, especially for walking with the class of 2024 as they complete their first year of high school, even though we were mostly virtual. We thank you for their successes and accomplishments. We thank you for their perseverance during hard moments and the lessons they learned. We thank you for the love they are sharing and the friendships they are navigating and the character they are developing. Be in our midst this evening as we celebrate all the good things you have already done in and through your children in the class of 2024. We ask this in Jesus' name, amen. St. Andre Bissette, pray for us. Blessed Father Moreau, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. At this time, it is our pleasure to recognize our ninth grade students for their academic effort and excellence. We will do our best to pronounce every student's name correctly, but please forgive us if we make a mistake. We will get it right in time for graduation, so don't worry. We will begin out with our honor roll students. Please welcome Ms. Tia Bell, our ninth grade counselor, and Mr. Brian Brower, our director of student activities, to announce the honorees. Good evening, everyone. I am honored to be among you all virtually. I hope that you feel my gratitude and appreciation for overcoming many accomplishments, but most of all, succeeding in a pandemic and something that we've never faced before. Kudos to you. The following awards are based on students' academic performance over the past three quarters. We will first recognize all of the students who have achieved the distinction of the Dean's List. Each of these students have earned a grade point average of at least a 3.250 through the first three quarters of this year. Good job again, it wasn't easy. Jaden Anderson, Cameron Harris, Jaden Queen, Layla Warwick, Trinity Williams, Anthony, Zanferdino the fifth. Congratulations again, students. The English translation for the Latin phrase cum laude is with praise. Over the past three quarters, these students' work merits recognition for being consistently above average. Each of these students has earned a grade point average of at least a 3.5 through the first three quarters of this school year. Mackenzie Anderson, Madison Babio, Jasmine Bass, Zachary Betts, Adam Broom, Jaden Brown, Jayla Coleman, Imani Culler, Nadia Fleming, Bailey Freeman, London Hawkins, Tyrell Hawkins, Ashley Henderson, Isaiah Inman, Habib Ja, Jaleel Johnson, Taylor Judith Jones, Taylor Lawton, Peter Luster, Daniel Marshall, Taylor Martin, Gabrielle McRae Phelps, Amaris Parker, Larry Roberts, Linwood Scott III, Gavin Simmons, Joffrey Varner, Adrian Walls, Savion Whitney, Robert Wiggins, and Kalila Wilson. Congratulations, students.
Next, we will recognize all those students who have achieved the distinction of magna cum laude. The English translation for the Latin phrase magna cum laude is with great praise. Over the past three quarters, these students have worked merits recognition for being con consistently in the range of high honors. Each of these students have earned a grade point average of at least 3.750 through the first three quarters of the school year. Sydney Adair, Malachi Booker, Chloe Boyd, Kiera Brown, Isaiah Buckley, Sydney Boombre, Torin Davis, Nyla Dawson, Bless Eckridge, Amari Fields, Marissa Elise Forte, Faith Harris, Christian Jackson, Kennedy James, Anthony Lancy II, Myla Larista, Vincent McDonald Mono Monahan, excuse me, Justin McCoy, Isaiah Morris, Damon Parker, Sydney Pop Cove, David Shy, Hannah, Hannah Swan, Jessica Waitley, Nehemiah Washington, Mariah Williams, Kyla Wilson. And my apologies for anyone's name that I messed up. Please give me a call and we can fix that later. Congratulations again, students. Next, we will recognize all those students who have achieved the distinction of summa cum laude. The English translation for the Latin phrase summa cum laude is with highest honor. Over the past three quarters, these students' work merits recognition for their consistent exceptional work, earning our highest academic recognition. Each of these students has earned a grade point average of at least 3.9 through the first three quarters of the school year. And this is the longest of the lists. Congratulations, students. Danica Ada, Caden Anderson, Tinuke Arigbabu, London Beckford, Taylor Bridges, Kai Brown, Naya Burwell, Aaron Carter, Xavier Carter, Olivia Clemens, Jabari Coleman, Janiah Collier, Donovan Carell, Antoinette Davis, Carmine DeGraff, Anthony Diallo, Olukorade Fadatan, Alyssa Field, Jaden Foster, Jaden Fox, Ingrid Francia, Brian Gardner, Paris George, Zaina Gilgis, Nathaniel Hairston, Asia Horn, Nina Jackson, Riley Jacobs, Anaya James Greer, Asante Johnson, Mireya Johnson, Nicholas Kelly, Shatori Kelly, Cameron King, Matthew King, Michael King, Mikael Matome, Mackenzie McClam, Franklin McClary, Mary McHale, Kayla Michener, Marilyn Morfa, Fatima Mosley, Raphael Mungia, Emma Nolte, Chinlodum Nikki Nwobe, Ofune Anita Anoche, Brianna Peralta, Lena Ramey, Rihanna Reynolds, Sydney Robinson, Zola Robinson, Alicia Scott, Nigel Scott, Skylar Scott, Vincent Smith, Nicholas Steed, Grace Taylor, Madison Taylor, Simone Telford, Juliana Thompson, Carlia Trowell, Lanai Vanterpool, Phoebe Walker, Zariah Wallace, Graciela Walters, Isaiah Washington, Nia Wilson, Amber Wimbish, Samara Witter, Jair Wynn, and Andrew Zhang. 
Congratulations, students. Thank you, Mr. Brower. Next, we will move into our departmental awards. There are two distinctions students can earn in a department, an Outstanding Achievement Award and a St. Andre Award. The Outstanding Achievement Award is given to a student in a course who led the class in academic excellence. These select students have set the bar of achievement for their classmates and they exemplify excellence through their daily work. Our St. Andre Awards are a tribute to a special man from the Holy Cross tradition. St. Andre, or as he's known during his life, Brother Andre, took great care meeting and greeting people as a doorkeeper at the St. Joseph's Oratory in Quebec, Canada. We honor a few young people with this distinction in memory of St. Andre because those being recognized represent the same ideals that St. Andre represented. Kindness, compassion, determination, uncompromising principles, respect for others, prayer, hope, piety, and charity. Good evening, everyone. My name is Ms. Brianna Carter, and I am here on behalf of the English department. I also teach the Freshman Gateway Seminar class. Tonight, for English 9, I would like to recognize for Outstanding Achievement Award, Jaden Fox, and for the St. Andre Award, Asante Johnson and Kalila Wilson. And for Honors English 9, I would like to recognize for the Outstanding Achievement Award, Kai Brown, and for the St. Andre Award, Michael King. Good evening. My name is Adam Greer and I am the theology department chair. Uh, and I have the honor this evening of being able to announce the theology award winners. For Theology 9, the Outstanding Student Award goes to Juliana Thompson. And this year we have three St. Andre Awards for Theology 9. And those are given to Jaden Heyman, Simone Sims, and Lena Ramey. Congratulations. Next, we would like to honor students for MCL, which is Modern Classical Languages. In Spanish one, our outstanding student is Alyssa Field. For St. Andre, Caden Anderson. And two Sancho Panza Awards go to Antoinette Davis and Jabari Coleman. For Honors French one, our St. Andre students are Jaden Fox and Naya Burwell. For the St. Xperia Award, we have two awards, Danica Ada and Samara Witter. For Honors French Three, our St. Xperia Award goes to Matthew King. For Arabic One, the St. Andre Award goes to Damari Mitchell. The Fatima Ala Ferrari Award goes to Jaden Anderson. For Honors Latin One, the St. Andre Award goes to Dominic Carmichael. And in Honors Latin Two, the St. Andre Award goes to Anthony Diallo. Congratulations, students. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Mary Mitchell Donahue, and I'm proud to serve as the department chair for the Fine Arts Department. For Honors Concert Band, the outstanding student is Mackenzie Anderson. And the St. Andre Award goes to Sydney Bumbrey. For concert band, the outstanding student is Naya Burnwell, and the St. Andre student is Skylar Scott. Symphonic band, outstanding student this year is Juliana Thompson. For honors symphonic band, the outstanding student is Mary McHale, and the St. Andre Award goes to Isaiah Morris. In Honors Wind Ensemble, the St. Andre student is Nicholas Kelly. 
For string orchestra, the St. Andre Award goes to Bless Eckridge. And in honors string orchestra, the outstanding student is Riley Jacobs. Jazz ensemble, St. Andre's student is Michael King. And for percussion ensemble, the outstanding student is Andrew Zhang. Moving on to concert choir, our outstanding student is Cameron King. And we have two St. Andre winners, Sydney Robinson and Linwood Scott. For show choir, the St. Andre student is Graciela Walters. In dance one, our outstanding student is Amani Culler and two St. Andre students, Anaya James Greer and Brianna Peralta. For dance two, the outstanding student is Paris George. And in dance three, our outstanding student is Amber Wimbish and St. Andre winners are Lene Vanderpool and Fatima Mosley. And now for traditional African and music dance one, the St. Andre winners are Amaris Parker and Brianna Reynolds. And an introduction to theater, our outstanding student is Lena Ramey and a St. Andre student is Brianna Peralta. And finally, in our drawing class, the outstanding student is Zainas Gilgis. Thank you and congratulations. Hello, I'm Jan Steger and I'm representing the science department. We would like to recognize the following students. For honors biology, the outstanding award goes to Brianna Peralta and Juliana Thompson. The St. Andre Award goes to Raphael Munguia, Asante Johnson, and Corday Fadatin. For biology, the outstanding award goes to Antoinette Davis, and the St. Andre Award goes to Kalila Wilson, Bless Eskridge, and Zariah Wallace. Thank you and congratulations, students. Good evening. I am Patrick Skirpon here representing our technology and uh, engineering department. And I would like to award uh, our outstanding student in computer programming to Rafael Munguia and our St. Andre Award for our web design class to Tineke Eric Babu. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. My name is Frank Oliver, and I'm representing the Physical Education Department, uh, specifically our ninth grade Active for Life course. And we like to recognize the following students for outstanding achievement. Jared Satterwhite and Danica Ada for the St. Andre Award, Imani Culler and Aaron Carter. Good evening. I'm Julie Cobbs. I'm the Social Studies Department Chair, and I have the honor of presenting the awards for um, government politics. <laughs> uh, so for our outstanding award, it goes to Brianna Reynolds. Uh, we have three St. Andre Awards, Matthew King, Rafael Mangia, and Phoebe Walker. In honors government and politics, we have outstanding award, Lena Ramey, and then we have three St. Andre Awards, Brian Gartner, Paris George, and Riley Jacobs. Congratulations.
Good evening. My name is Alicia Brown, and it is indeed an honor to represent the St. Joseph's program in recognizing the following recipients. Outstanding Achievement Award goes to Aaron Carter, and we have two recipients for the St. Andre Award, Jaden Hayden and Charlie Baluch. Thank you and congratulations, students. Good evening, my name is Susan Scott and I'm one of the freshman algebra teachers and I'm pleased to be presenting the Algebra Math Awards. Starting with Algebra One, outstanding is Franklin McClary. The St. Andre Award goes to Juliana Thompson. The Algebra One Lab, outstanding, goes to Aaron Carter. St. Andre, goes to Kalila Wilson. Our honors one, algebra, outstanding, to Riley Jacobs. St. Andre goes to Alucarde Fadidan. And our honors algebra two, outstanding, goes to Andrew Zhang, and we have two St. Andre, Kai Brown, and Raphael Mungia. Congratulations. And now we'll move to the special awards portion of our program. In addition to our academic awards this evening, we also have a few scholarship presentations. Allow me to welcome Ms. Bell back to begin the scholarship presentations. Ms. Bell. Thank you, Ms. Scott. It's been an honor working alongside you, assisting our freshmen in math and more. P's and Q Scholarship. The P's and Q Scholarship was created by my mentor, Mr. Craig Glover Hines, a former faculty member and 2009 graduate of Bishop McNamara High School. This scholarship is intended to give back to, the, to an institution that cemented the values instilled in Mr. Glover Hines by his late grandfather, Mr. Thomas Glover, and to also acknowledge the inner qualities, the potential in all students, which will lead to their prime. Thomas was Craig's hero and gave him the foundation which established qualities that Craig is passing down to the next generation. Most importantly, Thomas taught Craig how to be a Christian adult that he is today. The P's and Q scholarship comes with a $500 award towards next year's tuition. Please join me in congratulating this year's winner from the class of 2024, Ms. Maria Johnson. Congratulations, Maria. Roscoe C. Perkins Jr. Memorial Scholarship. The Roscoe C. Perkins Jr. Memorial Scholarship is presented annually to a rising sophomore enrolled at Bishop McNamara High School. The recipient of this award must maintain a 2.6 GPA and strive for excellence in AP, mathematics, science, aeronautical, or engineering. The student must also prove to be of good moral character, active in the community and participate in faith-based service. The Roscoe C. Perkins J. Memorial Scholarship comes with a $3,000 award towards next year's tuition. Please join me in congratulating this year's winner from the class of 2023, 
Mr. Daniel Marshall. And now back to Mrs. Carter. Thank you so much, Ms. Bell. And thank you so much for supporting and loving and mentoring and caring for our ninth grade students this year. We truly appreciate you. I have the pleasure of presenting the Stewart Family Legacy Scholarship. The Stewart Family Legacy Scholarship is an endowed by the Stewart family who have operated the Stewart Funeral Home for over a hundred years. The scholarship is awarded annually to a current student at Bishop McNamara High School who daily lives out the ideals of faith, leadership, and service. This year's recipient will receive an award in the amount of $1,000 to be used towards next year's tuition. Please join me in congratulating this year's winner from the class of 2024, Miss Jessica Wadley. Congratulations, Jessica. And now joining us virtually is Mrs. O'Neill. Mrs. O'Neill will be presenting the Keo Scholarship. Mrs. O'Neill. Good evening, everyone. The KEO Memorial Scholarship is awarded each year to a current male Bishop McNamara student and honors the life and legacy of Mr. Kevin Eugene O'Neill, who was a 2003 graduate of Bishop McNamara. He also attended Morehouse College as an honors student. As part of the application process, each applicant had to submit an essay outlining an experience or an event from this past pandemic year that led them to become a change agent in their community. 22 young men at McNamara submitted applications and as part of the 10 year anniversary of this award, each applicant will be receiving a $100 check from Kevin's godmother for their participation. Seven of those applicants are members of the class of 2024. Please join me in congratulating Savian Whitney, Jabari Coleman, Anthony Diallo, Brian Gardner, Jair Wynn, Vincent Smith, and Habib Jab. Their checks will be awarded to them on Kevin's birthday, which is July 28th. Thank you very much and congratulations, young men. Thank you so much, Mrs. O'Neill. Mrs. O'Neill has joined us virtually for the last few evenings. And then she joined us in person uh, for the junior award ceremony because our top award winner was a junior this year. Congratulations again to Christian Inman who earned a $1,100 scholarship. We continue to uh, be honored to uh, love and serve Kevin's family and to honor his legacy here at Bishop McNamara High School. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to congratulate all those students who were honored this evening for their academic effort. Thank you for joining us this evening. We are extremely proud of all of these students and look forward to having them back on campus in the fall as sophomores. Have a fantastic summer Mustangs and we look forward to welcoming back our students, uh, last names M through Z for the last couple of days of school. That concludes our program. Thank you so much and have a great evening.